السلام علیکم ویورس ویلکم ٹو مائی یوٹیوب چینل اشفاق سمر ولاگس ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس میننگ اینڈ اسٹرکچر آف کانسٹیٹیوشن اٹ از فرام بک فسٹ فار کلاس الیونتھ پولیٹیکل سائنس بی ویت می ٹل دا اینڈ آف دا لیکچر basically uh, this lecture is for class uh, 11th uh, meaning and structure of constitution so uh, before uh, discussing uh, constitution we'll just uh, see what constitution actually means uh, a constitution is a set of fundamental rules that determine how uh, a country or state is run Uh, so let's get started uh, meaning of constitution uh, a constitution of a state is a fundamental set of principles or established uh, precedents according to which the state uh, is governed uh, it outlines the organization powers and limits of government institutions as well as the uh, rights and duties of citizens Uh, it serves as uh, the supreme law of the land providing a framework for the functioning of the government uh, the protection of individual liberties and uh, the maintenance of uh, social order <clears throat> uh, constitution of india the constitution of india is the supreme law of the republic of india it lays down the framework uh, for the country's political system Uh, defining the power and responsibilities of government institutions safeguarding fundamental rights and outlining the principles of governance it is a set of rules and regulations guiding the administration of a country there is a photo of the book constitution of india so further uh, we'll the structure of indian constitution uh, the indian constitution is one of the longest and most uh, detailed written constitutions in the world uh, various components of the structure of the indian constitution can be seen uh, as uh, parts number one is parts uh, a part of the constitution refers to a division uh, within the constitution uh, that groups together articles on a similar subjects or themes so parts hisse hote hain constitution ke jisme mukhtalif jo articles hote hain wo usme shamil hote hain jo ek hi naviyat ki hote hain to parts mein shamil hote hain to further we will see the indian constitution is structured into various parts में बहुत सारी से इज डीलिंग विद ए स्पेसिफिक एस्पेक्ट ऑफ द कंट्रीज लीगल एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव और गवर्नमेंटल फ्रेमवर्क مختلف نویت کے اس میں ارٹیکلز ہوتے ہیں اوریجنلی देयर आर 22 पार्ट्स इन द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ऑफ इंडिया एज ऑफ नाउ देयर आर 25 पार्ट्स ऑफ द इंडियन कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन तो जब आईन हिंद बनाया गया तो इसमें 22 हिस्से रखे गए थे इसमें आईन की तो आज की डेट में इसमें 25 पार्ट्स हैं Uh, 25 parts further uh, uh, we'll see what are articles after parts there are articles so simply an article refers to a specific provision or clause uh, within the constitution that details various aspects of the country's legal and governmental framework to so, article mein makhsoos jo provisions hote hain ya clauses hote hain ayin ki jin mein تفصیل کے ساتھ مختلف آسپیکٹس جو کنٹری کے ہوتے ہیں ملک کے وہ اس میں شامل کیے جاتے ہیں تو ایچ پارٹ آف دا کانسٹیٹیوشن کنٹین سیورل آرٹیکلس نمبرڈ سیکنڈلی تو اس میں مختلف آرٹیکل جمع ہوتے ہیں اوریجنلی دیر وائر 395 آرٹیکلس ان دا کانسٹیٹیوشن آف انڈیا ایز اف ناؤ دا کانسٹیٹیوشن کنٹینز 448 آرٹیکلس شیڈولس آفٹر پارٹس اینڈ آرٹیکل دیر آر شیڈولس آف دا کنشن اے شیڈول ریفرس ٹو اے لسٹ آر 
table attached to the constitution that details certain additional information or guidelines relevant to the constitutional provisions तो इसमें वो तफसील के साथ वो जो होते हैं आइन के वो डिटेल्ड लिस्ट होते हैं या टेबल ऑफ कंटेंट्स होते हैं जिसमें वो रखे जाते हैं जिसमें खास किस्म की इंफॉर्मेशन होती है सो दे प्रोवाइड क्लियरिटी एंड सप्लीमेंट्री डिटेल्स मेकिंग द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन मोर कंप्रेंसिव एंड फंक्शनल ऑरिजिनली देयर वर एट शेड्यूल्स इन द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन जब आइन हिंद बनाया गया तो उसमें आठ शेड्यूल्स रखे गए थे सो एज ऑफ नाउ देयर आर 12 शेड्यूल्स इन द इंडियन कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन फर्दर enactment and adoption of the constitution indian constitution uh, the concept india was framed by the uh, constituent assembly which was established in 1946 uh, the president of the constituent assembly was dr rajendra prasad on 29th august 1947 a resolution was moved in the constituent assembly uh, for the appointment of a drafting committee to draft a permanent constitution of india at accordingly uh, the drafting committee was appointed under the chairmanship of dr bhim rao ambedkar uh, the drafting committee took a total of 166 days uh, which was spread over 2 years 11 months and 18 days to prepare a draft of the constitution the final uh, draft of the constitution was introduced in the constituent assembly on 4th november 1948 After many deliberations and some modifications, the draft constitution was declared as passed by the Constituent Assembly on 26 November 1949. Uh, this is known as the date of adoption of the Constitution of India. Uh, a few provisions of the Constitution came into force on 26 November 1949. However, the major uh, part of the Constitution came into force on 26th January 1950, making India a sovereign republic. This date is known as the date of enactment of the Constitution of India. And 26th January 1950 ke baad, jab hai, har saal 26 January ko yomi jamhuriya Hind banaya jata hai. So with this uh, uh, lecture. Uh, we have completed today's topic we will inshallah discuss the salient features of the indian constitution till then uh, allah hafiz take care so we will coming soon uh, channel ko like comment aur subscribe karna nahi bhuliye agar aap baat karna chahte to whatsapp number yahan par hai aur email id bhi diya hua hai to iske sath hi hum aap se uh, vidai chahte hain till then allah hafiz